It is time for another video. This one's going to be a little bit different. We're not doing racing today. As you can see outside, it is raining. It's raining pretty good, actually. I want to do a little comparison video, and it has to do with the windshield. So you have a couple ways of cleaning windshields. One, the normal way, just use some regular glass cleaner, which is cool. Keeps the windshield clean, but during rain, you have to use your wipers, obviously. You have to use your wipers anyway during rain. But then we're going to take this, and afterwards, we're going to compare it to this Rain X 2 in 1 glass cleaner that has rain repellent in it. We're going to see how good this stuff works and if it actually repels rain. And then finally, we're going to use actual true Rain X, the original straight up water repellent. And we're going to see how well each thing works. Obviously, we already know what that's going to do, but we need a comparison. So we're going to drive in all three. Now, hopefully, there's enough rain because these are spotty showers, so I may not have the opportunity to change each one in succession in the same rain. So this video may encompass a couple different days, but at least we'll get a start. So first thing we're going to do is just drive in the rain. I had it cleaned with this. None of this has been applied just to kind of get a baseline. And well, as you can see, no glass cleaner is exactly how it is anytime you drive. No different. Mm -hmm. Now that we got video of the untreated windshield in the rain, it's time to go ahead and try out this Rain X 2 in 1 glass cleaner. So, this is glass cleaner with rain repellent built in. Some people think, oh, this is just like Rain X. I'm going to show you it's not. <laughs> and I say this because I was watching a YouTuber who did some video with rain. People were like, why don't you use Rain X? Because, you know, rain was in a dash cam and all that. And then, in a future video, he was like, oh, I got the Rain X this time, so all you people can stop complaining. And then everybody was just like, that's not real Rain X. And that's kind of part of why I made this video. So my windshield's dirty as heck because it's been a little bit since we drove in the rain. So I need to clean it. So since we already got the untreated, I'm going to clean it with this. Now, it's not raining today. I'll probably reapply this again on a day it is raining. But I need to at least clean the windshield right now. So let's clean it. All right, cleaned and treated with this. We're going to keep this on so that when it does rain, we're going to do apply one more time so it's nice and fresh right before it rain. All right, and we're back um, for part two of this comparison. So we have this Rain X 2 in 1 glass cleaner and rain repellent again. And I've been waiting for it to rain, and it finally is. I'm actually leaving work right now, but it was just dry here a minute ago. It wasn't raining, so I treated it again just to make sure it's nice and fresh, and now it is. So we'll be recording with this phone so you can have a close up of the windshield and of course my POV view. As we're going, I'm not even going to use the wipers yet, even though I obviously need to but I'm, I want to get on the freeway because we're going to get on the freeway here in a second just see what a little bit higher wind will do for that. All right, so here we go. I haven't used my wipers, freshly treated, and we're not getting a lot of rain, but as you can see, it's not necessarily beating off. It's starting to move a little bit here. I'm up to 50 miles an hour, but I definitely need my wipers. I, if I'm just city street driving, I definitely have to have my wipers on. So let's keep going, see what happens. Looks like we might be getting out of the rain though, so I don't know how good this test is, but maybe we'll hit some more, we'll see. Okay, so we got a little bit more sprinkling starting. Let's hope we get some rain. And actually what I'm gonna do, normally I need to head north to go home, but because I wanna get this video done for you guys, I'm gonna go south because there is definitely rain out that way. So I'm gonna go out of my way and go south a little bit. Hopefully get some rain so we can get a little better better video. Up. All right, well, here we go. We got us a little bit of rain chasing it down and we caught a little bit. So I'm doing 60 miles an hour right now. You can see a little bit's rolling off, but not too much different than an untreated windshield. So right now the rain X portion of it really doesn't do that much. So as you can see, uh, this isn't good for driving. So we're gonna have to use a wiper. So let's go ahead and give it a wipe. And now we haven't 
use the wipers in a while the <laughs> rain is building up a little bit faster so it's it's coming off a bit better now yesterday we drove in the rain with the rain x two-in-one glass cleaner so now what we need to do is put the real rain x on because it is raining right now so this is the real rain x this is just the original true straight up rain x which is kind of like a wax so what you want to do basically clean your windshield, which I want to clean anyway to get any of that two-in-one off so that that doesn't contaminate this test. And you take this, kind of apply it like a wax on a cloth and just do circular motions, let it dry to a haze and wipe it off just like that. So let's go ahead, clean the glass, get this applied. Okay, with that clean, let's go ahead and apply this. And you can see it's just kind of a clear liquid. And so you're supposed to apply it to a cloth, and that's what we'll do. Okay, and that's pretty much it. So you can see where I've applied it, and now you just gotta kind of let it dry to a bit of a haze. So just a few minutes, but again, just like wax. And while I'm letting it dry to a haze, just so you know, you can also put this on your side windows, back glass, your side view mirrors. Okay, I'd say that's dried to a slight haze, so let's go ahead, wipe it off. Okay, rain next is applied. We're just going to wait for the heavier part of rain come in, and once it, once it comes in, I'm gonna hop in, go for a ride, see how it works. All right, well here is the rain, so let's do what most people don't do. Get into my 11 second car and go driving in the rain. First, the cold start. All right, here we go, backing up into the rain. You can see it's all beating up already. I'd say it's beating pretty good. Obviously there's a lot of rain right now, but look at that, just rolling right off. All right, I'm doing about 30 miles an hour right now, and you can see the rain's already kind of coming off. It's coming up way better than it was with that two-in-one glass cleaner. And we're kind of underneath a downpour right now, so it's not coming off very fast, but fast enough and not using my wipers at all. I'm up to about 35 now, coming off pretty easily. So if we were on the freeway, this would be coming off even better. In fact, we're gonna get on the main road. Uh, we'll be doing about 60 miles an hour on it. So we'll see how that goes there. Man, you hit the brakes and it just all falls down basically. started moving and even then it was kind of slow. Now I will say this, now I, again, Rain-X is not new to me. I used to use it all the time religiously on my truck. So if you want the best rain, the best beating properties and all that, 
pretty much after a rain like this, like if I was just doing, you know, 30 minute drive or whatever with this, it'll still be there afterwards, but it's gonna lose some of its effectiveness. And so you would have to reapply it. Like I can get away with not using a windshield wiper right now. If I came back tomorrow, it rained again, it wouldn't be as effective and I would need to reapply it. And quick PSA, just because I'm doing this without wipers, does not mean I condone not using your wipers. Again, testing purposes, see how it goes. I love how when you brake though, it all just comes tumbling forward. We are back home, back in the garage, made it. Now you've seen a difference. Hopefully that helped. Now obviously if you've been following me, subscribe, see my videos, you probably have an idea of an ulterior motive I had for using a rain -X, which will be happening within uh, pretty soon. So. Thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. See you in the next one.